Hey everybody, I hope you're having a great day. I hope you're getting your writing done. As for me, i um, been struggling trying to get myself to write again, so I've actually been doing some research trying to see what some of my favorite authors do to keep themselves writing. Um, it's not really writer's block. I have plenty to write about. It's just sitting down. There's just so much information that I want to put down. I don't really know where to start. The story I was working on, I'm, I'm growing out of it. Uh, I don't think it's exciting enough. Uh, I, I've got some new ideas I want to build into it that I think will make it more exciting. Uh, this is that story about Spaceball. I think I'm getting rid of the idea of Spaceball itself, changing the game itself. Um, uh, but I'm, I'm not sure. I, I need more information, more twists, more plot lines, uh, a bigger uh, villain of some sort. And I, I haven't come up with that yet. And that's, that's what I've been struggling with at the moment. Um, during my research, I, I looked up Piers Anthony. He's a fantasy writer. Uh, apparently, he's got 180 books that are published in his name. Um, he's known for the Xanth novels. He's up to, I think, he's got 42 right now and 43 and 44 are in the pipelines to be published. Um, I wanted to know how he was able to write so many books. Uh, he's able to write four to six books a year, um, just pumping them out. And what he said was he basically wrote for six hours a day. Um, he wrote for re writes for a couple hours in the morning, uh, a couple hours in the afternoon, and maybe 30 minutes to an hour in the evening. Um, when he comes to a point where he's not writing, where he's stuck, he, he said he puts in brackets and just starts doing a stream of consciousness trying to figure out in his mind, work things out, and try to figure out where he's going to go from there, and then he closes the brackets and keeps writing, and then when he goes back to edit, he pulls out all those brackets, uh, those thought, thought patterns out of the story, uh, that way they're not in the novel. Um, I thought this was a great idea. Uh, he says now he doesn't do it in the document itself, he actually jumps over to a, th uh, a stream of consciousness document and starts writing there and then bounces back over to the story when he's ready to start writing again. Um, so I'm thinking about doing that, just sitting down and writing anything, just getting it out and thinking about the ideas and building on the ideas uh, in a stream of consciousness, just working it out in my head instead of just thinking about it for days and days and days and not getting any writing done. Anyway, that's, that's what I'm thinking about right now. Um, what are you guys thinking about? Or how's your writing going? I know uh, Camp Nano Rimo is going on right now. I did not join in. Uh, I thought about it, but uh, you know it's eight days in, and I haven't uh, 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 signed up for it. So uh, I'm just going to focus on getting my writing, doing some writing every day. Anyway, you guys have a great day. Make sure you keep writing, and we will see you tomorrow.